Okay, I don't know. I do not know why I did that. <sighs> hey guys, Nerf Gun Reviewer 331 here. Today's video is going to be a few more reviews. Um, first off, we have here is the X Shot Duel, which is an Arizona gun for like eight bucks, I think. Shoots discs and darts of their uh, very own. Next up is the Nerf Elite Rampage, which is the Sonic Ice series, I should say. Comes with a 25 dart drum. 25 darts, no stock, surprisingly. And uh, last but not least, I do not have the barrels with me. They're actually over there on that table. I have here the Quick Fire 12, which comes with 12 darts and two revolving barrels that you can take out of the gun. So first of all, I'm going to do this first, then that, and then, then that. In that general order, uh, hopefully. So without further ado, let's get started. Hello everybody, this is the Nerf Gun Review 331. Actually, I don't need the intro for this one. I've already said the intro. Um, so this is uh, the Quick Fire 12 from Airzone. Comes with two of these revolving barrels. One and two. Comes with 12 of these darts. They're like little flathead uh, Nerf dart, or Air Zone darts. The only problem with mine is it came with 10, not 12. I got a little annoyed, but not like completely annoyed. Fit pretty snug in the barrel, and uh, best of all, it works with th these uh, this barrel with the, the gun and everything. It uses uh, it can use the uh, the Air Zone guns or the Air Zone darts. There we go, Air Zone darts. The Nerf Elite darts, which is really good. That means that you can like put Elite darts instead of these crappy old Air Zone darts, and um, they can go a little bit further, a little bit faster too. The uh, Nerf Suction darts also work with these too. The orange and black tip ones work with this as well. So let's get right into the review. So, so the review is on, like I said before, the Quick Fire 12 from Airzone comes with these uh, the two revolving barrel uh, things the revolving barrels I should say and uh, comes with 10 tw actually mine came with 10 darts but I uh, meant to say it comes with 12 darts I would assume it would come with 12 darts because mine, even though mine came with 10 that's what I'm assuming and uh, to me Right off the bat, I'm going to say that this reminds me of a Star Trek gun, or something on the lines of it, without the barrels, of course. I don't know why, but it just it just reminds me of something from Star Trek. It looks really cool. It's it kind of like I said, it just it just reminds me of Star Trek. And um, yeah, I will honestly say I do not I do and do not like this gun at the same time. Uh, for the first part of it, if you put a barrel in this spot, which I will demonstrate, if you put the barrel in here, there's a little switch right here that you can like pull to release the barrel, but it's stuck in place literally, and you have to rip it out, which I don't, I do not like. I do not like doing that. Um, it's, I guess it's the revolving pistol category of what it is and what it's like. It's, uh, like I said, it comes with 12 darts, 2 revolving barrels, and the gun. And, um, pretty good handle, trigger, everything like that. And I, I can't stop saying it, but it reminds me of something from Star Trek. I'll stop saying that now. The, uh, the release switch for the barrel is right on top of here. You push, you push it, and then you can re release the barrel, and then, whoops, and snap it right back into place with a new one. Now, in case, unless you have a speed loader of some some uh, of some kind, or more of these, this is kind of an okay blaster. I mean, if like I said, if you had more of these, uh, hold on a second. if you have more of these barrels, revolving barrels, I should say, if you have more of these revolving barrels, like four, you would probably last. Uh, let's see, six times. Uh, that's like 24 shots, depending on what darts you put in. You put in elite darts, these will work pretty well, but you have to push them in just a little bit more than usual than these darts. These darts fit pretty nice and snug. 
But uh, if you put in a late dart, you have to uh, like jam it in in there. And I kind of don't like doing that because it kind of ruins the dart in the long run. I keep on doing that and everything. Uh, I guess I'll just dive right into the pros and cons. <clears throat> pros comes with 12 darts uh, and two revolving barrels, which is, I guess, let I guess it's twice than average, because uh, average is usually about six nerf darts and then a clip and then the gun itself. I like that a lot. It's pretty cool. Um, the just looking at it right now, it's just really cool and. Uh, even though without the barrels, it's pretty much useless. It looks pretty cool as a, you know, as a prop, uh, and things like that. The loading process is pretty difficult, but you can, if you do, if you're like fast enough with your hands, you can just snap it right back into place without having to fiddle with the barrel and trying to get it into into its place. Uh, another pro would be that it works. It's compatible with most Nerf darts. And Arizona darts and possibly Busby darts. I haven't tested the Busby darts yet, but I'll test it soon. Uh, I probably won't let you guys know because it's if it use if it uses the lead darts, the Busby darts complete are completely useless because I guess in most cases Busby darts are inferior to Nerf elite darts. It, like I said, inferior in most cases or something like that. Um, Let's see. the uh, The handle's good. The trigger's nice. If it's the gun itself could fit easily a a big person's hand like mine. Pretty nice. Pretty smooth. The one thing I do not like about this is it has a very. Uh, well, I'll just show you now. You have to really push with a little bit of. You have to like like push it. Push the uh, the cocking uh, mechanism. You have to kind of. Pull it really hard just to, you know, shoot the gun and everything. If you don't, if you like do this and it slips, the dart will shoot out almost every time. Depending on if you use these Arizona darts or things like that, it will shoot out every time if you if you like try and cock it and then you think you cocked it and it shoots out the dart. That could be a good thing if you're trying to you know do a sneak attack like boom, 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 boom. But the problem with that is the barrel doesn't rotate. It rotates every time you do a successful cock and then shoot. But, uh, yeah. Let's see what else. Um, I guess I'll go into my, uh, how I rate things as the, for like a Nerf gun review. The clip size is twice than, twice than average, which is six to me. Six darts and a clip and, and what I said before, the gun itself. Then you have um, rate of fire. Rate of fire depends on how fast you shoot the gun. If you do this, it's going to go by pretty slow, but you steady your shots. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, you get to steady your shots a little bit more. You get a little bit more accuracy. But if you do this, which I'm poorly trying to do, but the main idea is you just do a rapid fire where you just do just do that then pretty much pointless I mean I mean it shoots the darts really fast but you have basically no accuracy whatsoever you just just doing that all over the place and it just doesn't work um, let's see the reload time is twice as long depending on if you have a speed loader if you have a speed loader it's gonna go by really quick no problem if you have uh, let's put it this way if you have if you don't have a speed loader and individually put the darts one by one, it will take a very long time. And unless you have, you know, like more of these, uh, hold on. If you have more of these barrels, and or found, found out a way to like make it a single shot or something like that, or make it easier to load it, uh, EX uh, speed loader, this is kind of like the worst gun to be re reloading because it's a revolver, then you have to put the revolver in, kind of sucks. Uh, the range, depending on what dart you use, it all depends on what darts, but I guess the darts that come with it, it's, it's okay for a stock gun. Um, but if you were to put elite darts in this, it goes a little bit further, but still, it's, it's good. Not bad, it's not great, it's just good. 
The accuracy on this thing is great though. It uh, hits, pretty much hits the target every time, which is nice. That means you get 12, shot, 12, uh, 12 shots and they're very accurate. <clears throat> Last but not least, the specialty. Specialty is, it's a, uh, it's a revolving gun, but you can take out the revolver itself and put in another one, which is pretty, pretty cool t for me and pretty much for a few others. Might want to get this gun. Oh, and another thing, uh, just notice this now, if you are having, if you have a hard time putting, ball, like, barrels in, like, revolving barrels into a gun, don't get this gun. It, it, it might, you may have a very hard time trying to get the gun barrel out and then putting it back in. Because it, it takes you like 10, 15 seconds tops to load, to actually load the barrel in. And you may not have that, that much time in an actual Nerf War. But without further ado, I'll end the video now. The overall video, the overall review on this would be about... 8.5, I'm going to say 9 out of 10. I'm going to say 9 out of 10 because, you know, even though the ranges are pretty sucky sometimes, there are a few lucky shots where the darts will go a little bit further than others. And, uh, you know, depending on what darts you use, if you use the elite darts, you're going to go a lot further, but still, you know, not as far further as you would think. I also bought uh, Nerf section darts, which are actually in that bag over there. It's off camera. Um... They go a little bit further, but not as further as the elite darts do. So, without further ado, hope you guys. Uh, I'm just gonna end the video now. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, understood it, and uh, yeah, that's it. Quick fire 12. Uh, that comes with two revolving barrels, 12 darts of these kinds, and the gun itself. Well, mine came with 10, but you know, hopefully it comes with 12 for two barrels. So, yep, see you guys later. Next up will be the Nerf Elite Rampage Sonic Ice series. I'm not going to put that in the title, but... So, yeah, that's it. See you guys later.